Hello everyone, my name is Ahit Bashir. Today I am going to show you the project that is the flood monitoring system using Arduino Uno, GSM module and ultrasonic sensor. So let's start the project. So for this project you have, first you have an Arduino Uno, uh, GSM module, LCD display, breadboard, a buzzer, ultrasonic sensor and some jumper wires okay so let us start the wiring of this project after that we will upload the code from our system so watch it first of all I will bring an ordinal here and connect the positive and ground to this breadboard so I will connect the ground and the 5 volt of the Arduino Uno to the breadboard okay so we have connected uh, mp3 uh, sorry we have connected gsm module uh, we have to connect uh, our ultrasonic sensor and also display and a buzzer that's why i am going to use this breadboard so first of all i am connect the positive to the positive sign of this breadboard okay here and negative to the negative sign of the breadboard here okay so after that uh, i will place a gsm module here you can see so i'm going to place it here and now i am going to connect the uh, audio uh, ultrasonic sensor so connect the plus 5 volt of vcc of ultrasonic sensor to the vcc of this bed board here similarly crown connect ground to the ultrasonic sensor ground of the Arduino here ok now here are two things one is trigger and another is echo so it depends upon code so I will show you code I have either trigger pin as the pin number 8 here I will connect it to the pin trigger to the pin number 8 here and echo to the pin number 9 ok so after that I am going to connect to the uh, LCD okay and also we place I will put a buzzer here this is a buzzer okay so now I will connect to the uh, LCD here so we connect the SCL to the pin of to the A5 pin of the Arduino and SD to the pin number A4 of the Arduino SL to the A5 and SD to the A4 okay similarly now I connect the ground ground of the Arduino and VCC to the VCC of the Arduino okay so now it's complete setup here so now I have to add uh, GSM and also a buzzer here so now I will connect the GSM's uh, first pin the ground of here you can see first pin the ground now connect the ground of the GSM to the ground of the Arduino and connect the uh, this pin the second pin after the antenna pin the, sec the second before the antenna pin the second pin is VCC okay connect the VCC to the or the VCC okay so now I am going to the buzzer so connect the negative of the buzzer here is the negative pin of the buzzer uh, to the ground of the Arduino here Okay, and the buzzer pin is here. I can see, show you the buzzer pin is. I have set the buzzer pin at pin number five of the Arduino. So I will connect to the pin number five of the Arduino here. You can see. Okay. So I connect to the pin number five. Now we have to connect the RX and TX of the uh, GSM module to the RX TX of the Arduino so here the RX and TX of the Arduino is a pin number uh, 10 is RX and 11 is TX so I will connect the RX of the Arduino to the TX of the GSM model TX is the first pin here is the UIRT communication so I, we use the cross connection RX to TX and TX to RX 
and similarly i am going to connect the tx of the ordinal pin number 11 to the rx of the gsm module okay so here is a full setup now i will connect the cable and upload the code okay so i am going to connect the cable you can see here is a cable i am going to connect here first of all first uploading the code just just remove the 5 volt from there and then upload the code i am going to remove this 5 volt from this now i will upload the code first so i, I have connected it now i am going to upload the code so you can see here i am going to upload the code from my laptop so i am going to connect the code so it's uploading combining the sketch so if you want so guys finally code is uploading here and if you want semantics and also code uh, then do comment and also subscribe my youtube channel and follow my facebook page tag z so finally uh, our course is uploading here and we are going to check our system it will work or not so let's check the system check it okay now connect the 5 volt here to the 5 volt and our display is connected here the gsm module also working here now we are going to show that if it will work or not okay so if i go close to this sensor will it work or not it's working okay so that means if if the I put there well if the value is less than three then it will be here. Then I will remove my hand and you will see. So it's okay. So our project is working also. Guys, I hope you like this video. If you like my video, then do subscribe my YouTube channel and follow my Facebook page tag there for more informative videos like that. Thank you.